All right, guys, this is a little guard lock. I got this off of eBay, and the only reason I bought it is several of you had sent me emails saying this is really tough to pick. It only cost $4.20, I think. It wasn't very much at all, but you said it had security pins in it. And at that price, I was kind of surprised to hear that. It, it works beautifully. It's great for, I guess, a little suitcase or something. No high security application. The pins on mine are not that great but let's do what we do what we got to do here all right let's go ahead and try to use some top of the keyway i'm gonna zoom in a little bit maybe not that one maybe i'll try this one got them color coded red is the thickest then white then blue and then i got a yellow one that's the thinnest of all all right, let's try this. I'll tell you what, first of all, before we do that, because of this bidding, even if it's got security pins, why don't we just use bottom of the keyway tensioning and just see if we can rake this dude open using this worm from Sparrows, if I can get him in there, try that. And I got a fault set. Let's loosen up. I'm gonna use very light tension. And again, I got another fault set. So indeed, there's at least a spool in here. Lighter tension yet. And slowly apply it while I'm raking. And I'm getting hung up on that spool, which appears to be right up here in the front. All right, so it does have security pins. So that's a really good thing for a lock at this price point. All right, let's go ahead and try to single pin pick it then. If that's that was the right one, yeah, we'll try that. I will hold it and let me grab a pick that can work from the bottom of the keyway. This is my rat yoke, so I'm putting a hundred and something dollar pick at risk here, but it's I think it's fairly low risk. All right, light tension, find a binder, and there it is, pin four. Pin three, close will click. Oh, fault set. I got a fault set, so now I'm looking for counter rotation because a fault set indicates a security pin, probably a spool. Where are you? Oops. Almost pulled out my tension wrench. There it is, pin three, counter rotation. And no open. Right here in the front, I have pin one. Again, I got another fault set. So more than one security pin. I touch three. I have a deeper fault set. All right, where are you? It's the last one, naturally. Pin five, counter rotation. Come on. And I've lost it. I've lost my fault set. There's three again, and we got an open. $4.20, man. Guard padlock. If you guys are looking for a training lock for spools, this is probably the most inexpensive choice I've run into in a very long time. As again, I found it on eBay, $4 is something, not a bad price. Anyway, go grab one if you want to train yourself on spools. Appreciate your time, guys. Stay safe, stay legal, and keep sending in those tips when you find interesting locks. Appreciate it. Each of these videos takes four to six hours to record, edit, and publish, so I'd really appreciate it if you show your support by subscribing and clicking on the like button. Thanks, guys.